Hey, what's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel Thick Whips and today we got a special feature film video with our friend James. What's your forte? <laughs> guys what is happening welcome back to the channel that was uh, Jay in the beginning as we all know mr. white teeth <laughs> mr. what's your forte built different today yes, with this era green m5 competition the last time we had this car on the channel he had actually just bought it he got rid of the g80 for this car it's originally Donington gray had it wrapped in era green but we're gonna go into all of the modifications and everything he's done so far this car is actually it's actually pretty fast he can tell us a little bit more about the modifications. If you guys don't know James, what's your forte? He's got a YouTube channel, a good friend of mine, been friends basically subscribe. since I started this channel. Yeah, subscribe to him. <laughs> I'm gonna have everything linked down below. Um, James, welcome back. Yes, tell sir. us a little bit about your Era Green M5 competition. I know when I first got this car, a lot of people was mad. A lot of people was like, how can you get rid of the G80? How, how, how? I knew when I got this, I had a plan for it. I knew I wasn't keeping it stock. I already knew I was wrapping it when the time I got it. We're looking at the exterior right now, so we're gonna start on that. So the exterior, as he said, is a wrap, and those are tech Era Green, wrapped by Pristine Wraps here in Charlotte, North Carolina. The front lip was provided by Souvenir. John, this front lip may look familiar to you because it's the GTS style front lip. So you see how it doesn't go all the way to the yeah. edges. It's GTS style. I think it looks very good on this car. And we also have the souvenir provided this CS style hood as well. So it's got the CS style cuts and then a power dome. I just thought the regular hood on this car looked very like vanilla. So I wanted to throw a little flair into it. I think it really added the aggression to this car. I think it needed to the front end. One other thing I did on the front end, when I wrapped the car, I did wrap this lower mouth section here in black. They kind of give it more of an aggressive look in the front. A lot of people thought I added a piece, but just, we just wrapped it. So as you guys see, this is kind of a little baby CS. So I got the CS yellow LEDs right there. These were supplied by R44 out of, out of the UK. Shout out to those guys for getting those sent to me. Um, and then if you can look kind of right in there, I do have the Autotechnic intake scoops, carbon fiber right there. That kind of flows right into the intakes. We got the wheels, <laughs> BC Forge HCS 21 inch wheels. They are a brushed gloss gray finish with black hardware. I was on Facebook one day, just looking. Somebody said, oh, I got wheels for sale for M5. Went and looked at them. I was like, yo, I need these wheels. How much? Wheels and tires, 4K. What? Wheels and tires, 4K? They pretty much brand new. I hit my boy up, Mike, and Slow Speed. Subscribe. Up in New York. The seller was in New York. He went and looked at them for me, told me they was good. I got them. 21 by 10 in the front, 21 by 11 in the rear. We got 285, 30, 21 tire, 295, 30, 21 tire. To finish out the side, I do got some carbon fiber uh, mud flaps here. And then I also have a M Performance style side skirt. Then to finish it out in the back, I kept it pretty simple back here. I didn't go too crazy. Went with like a competition spoiler here in carbon fiber supplied by Keys Motorsports. I have a mold carbon diffuser. This, this diffuser right here is pretty rare. I'm not gonna get into it. There's a lot of stuff with the mold carbon a lot of people don't like, but I had to wait and wait and I got this diffuser and I love it. It's super aggressive. It looks good, it's finished good. The fit and finish was perfect. Um, and then I also ended up going with some carbon fiber and performance exhaust tips. Nice. What suspension are you on? KW has kit. So that was also supplied by Keys Motorsports. How do you like it? I would say it rides better than stock. Yeah. So this car is notorious stock for being too stiff. The KW has kit, it keeps the stiffness when you're in Sport Plus. When you're in Comfort, it, it keeps it a little more comfortable, like you a little more tolerable. On the uh, PS4S's for Michelin? Yep. So the wheels were wrapped in PS4S. It came with the $4,000 deal that I got. So it was like perfect. Yeah, that's a, that's a good deal. Tires really? alone are like the, what? Two grand. Yeah, two grand. 21s. 
I mean, you only have two options in this size, Pirelli's or Michelin's. We're going Michelin's all day. First thing you see when you open it inside is the steering wheel. The steering wheel was supplied by Carismo Design. I have a similar type steering wheel on my G80. So you have the kind of the hexagonal design there with a the flat bottom. And then I also went with the Alcantara inside. And I went with the Alcantara because you got to match the Alcantara on the roof. Rest of the interior, I kind of added these uh, carbon fiber overlays. Mm -hmm. They're by Auto Technic. Added those over all the pieces. It was like a, br a brushed aluminum, and I decided to go with a carbon just to kind of match with the steering wheel. Yeah, it looks really good. I like this color combo. This, this, uh, the brown gets yeah. the arid green is like really cool. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, there was like a little controversy on TikTok about that, but we're not gonna get. We're not gonna get. All right, so as far as performance, tell me, why don't you pop the hood, show us what we got. Oh, yeah. yeah. What we got, what we got, what we doing. Yeah, I'm not one of those guys. This car's, this car's on just pump gas only, right? What? What's pump gas? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I'm not one of those guys. I'm not afraid to share my mods, you know? Yeah, no, uh, no grudges. No, no grudges. yeah. So, underneath here, I start with the dress-up stuff first. So, we got Downstar dress-up bolts and titanium finish. Nice. We also got the golden golden wrench black line caps right there. And that's actually an exclusive. I was one of the first ones with this actual fuel cap right there with the washer fluid cap. Big things in here. We're going with the Armor Speed carbon fiber intakes. So this is a full carbon intake to here is the Armor Speed unit right there. Mm -hmm. um, so there is an intake cone underneath these actual covers here. Yeah. And then we also going with the Eventuri turbo inlets. So this is a hot V design. So the turbos are actually right here. Mm -hmm and this feeds right into the turbos. We got full catless downpipes from MAD, Mastery of Art Design. So I got the primaries and secondary catless downpipes. Um, otherwise than that, the exhaust is stock. Competition model comes with a sport exhaust from factory. Mm -hmm. um, and then that's about it. On pump gas, I'm making 700 wheel, 680 torque. <laughs> Right now, the car is currently on E40. I'm testing out my E40 tune from my tuner, Uku. Um, right now, his, his E40 tunes, the car, their cars usually make around 750 wheel and 690 torque. The car is capable of a lot more power, but I told him I wanted a safe tune because these cars are notorious for bending rods. If I build it, it will be a thousand horsepower gold build if I if I do do the rods. And this car can take it, so it'll be it'd be a monster. It's already a monster, as you guys will see today. Yeah. And you you recently went to the track. Uh, what what did it run at the track? Um, at the track, it was kind of cold. I didn't get a good launch, but I still was able to run a, a 10.63, and I was on pump 93 at that time, so I wasn't on E. <laughs> I'm suspected to be low tens, like really, really. We're talking 10 1, 10 flat on the E40. So um, I plan to go back to the track very soon. If I can get some good tires by the end, I might be able to run 9 9, but we'll see. Y'all have to stay tuned for that. Yeah, see so if I can run into so nine. The goal is to be in the nines, right? Yeah, 9 9 is my goal yeah. without having to build the engine. If I can get that, then I'll be I'll be happy. I'll probably, if I hit 9 9, I might not even do, might not, I ain't, might not even touch it. <laughs> I'm just throw the towel in. Yeah, let's get some exhaust clips and then um, go for a drive. <laughs> All you hear is just turbo speed. <laughs> it sounds good. It's not, a lot of people thought it was like, somebody asked me was it a turbo diesel. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna do a little launch. And we got Jay in the back. I think the last time I rode in this car, you were on pump gas. I was on a, a OTS. You were on a, OTS, uh, OTS stage two map. Mm -hmm. And it was pump. Yeah. You sure you're ready? You sure you ready? <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm bolted in with three seatbelts on. So. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I bought my ball down. Oh my god, this oh. thing is fast. Oh my god. Oh yeah, one thing.
thing I forgot. I did do a trans tune, stage three. <laughs> 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 We're like a streetcar on 21s? That's ridiculous, yeah. dude. That's like stupid. Yeah, that's quick. That's quick. That's quick. That's quick. <laughs> Have you raced anyone with this setup yet? Like um, on the street or anything? Like fucking yeah. Really? Yeah, I, I'm, I, I can't say the first person that I raced because, you know, I don't want to cause anything, but I, I was able to hang with a really, really fast car I didn't think I was supposed to hang with. And then um, me and Yusuf um, raced again because everybody saw he got me at and the Darlington. G80. The G80. Uh, G80, but he was on corn and I wasn't. I was on 93 and he got me. Damn. He got me on E40 and I was on 93. Damn. But uh, when we was um, when we raced the little bit the other day, um, when we both were on corn, we mm -hmm. were neck and neck up to a very high speed that I don't want to say on camera. I may have had like that much on them, but maybe because of the front lip or something. Like, but they're was, but they're very comparable. Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. And that car is four hundred pounds lighter. Yeah. And then I'm a hundred pounds more than Yusuf. So was yeah. this car weigh? This car is like forty two, forty three hundred. Okay. What are they? What did you say? What you? What are they? Oh shit! Dude. Oh, 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 oh. What Let's go! <laughs> <Not just. laughs> Man, all that just to go 20 miles an hour. Yeah, I'll tell you. No, that's crazy. Just to go the speed limit. All right, guys, so that is James's car. What's your forte here? Make sure you guys go subscribe to him. I'm going to have all this stuff linked down below. This thing is no joke, man. It is fast and it's only going to get faster, which is like, <laughs> it's kind of scary. <laughs> but uh, thank you, man. Thank you yes, for sir. joining me on the channel Always. again. If you see me on the streets, just keep moving. <laughs> I just laugh, laugh, laugh. <laughs> I'm all right, guys, peace out. See you next time. Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel Thick Whips and we fuck. Hey, what's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel Thick Yeah. Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. It's Jay, Mr. Perfect Smile. Today we got a per fuck not. Nah, fuck it. Let's just use the other one. I lost my touch.